This is the NPH, the first nitrogen purifier through hydrogen built by Atlas Copco. Ben and Elias will explain what makes the NPH the ideal high purity nitrogen solution. Ben, this is quite a clean and compact machine. Indeed, and especially when you compare it to a traditional nitrogen generation system. In a system without an NPH, you will see the larger GA compressor and the larger NGP+. And that's because removing that last bit of oxygen to achieve the highest purity requires a lot more energy. In a system with the MPH, as you can see here, both the compressor and the generator are sized smaller because we can produce nitrogen of a lower purity, which requires less feed air, which then again saves on energy costs and allows for smaller machines. That all adds up to a very compact footprint that will please customers who do not have a lot of space. Sounds good. Before we take a look at the individual features, can you explain how the MPH works? Yes. So this is where it all starts and where it ends. We have the low purity inlet for nitrogen, the hydrogen inlet, and the high purity outlet for nitrogen. The low purity nitrogen enters through this path and this is where the MPH measures the nitrogen flow and the purity to mix it with the right amount of hydrogen. Before this mix then enters the reactor right there. This reactor contains a catalyst which enables a reaction between the hydrogen and the oxygen still present in the low purity nitrogen. That reaction removes the remaining oxygen, boosting the nitrogen purity. It's a very effective chemical process where only moisture and heat are generated as byproducts, both of which we can deal with. And what you get then at the outlet, right here, is nitrogen with a 5.0, even up to 6.0 grade purity. The highest we can achieve with our nitrogen generators themselves is grade 5.0, or even 5.5 if we oversize them. But as we mentioned before, it takes a lot of effort and feed air. The MPH can remove this last bit of oxygen much more efficiently. I see the MPH comes with the electronic on touch controller. Well, control is key, also on a purifier. Uh, and of course, because customers need easy and remote monitoring of their machine status and performance. But the electronic on touch controller is also the brain of the MPH and it manages its automated performance and protective features, both of which we will get into in a minute. But equally important though, is that the Electronicon also optimizes the hydrogen dosing to ensure that customers get the right nitrogen purity without using too much hydrogen. So at the nitrogen inlet of the MPH, we measure the flow and the purity uh, that comes into the machine. Uh, and then the Electronicon will calculate the right amount of hydrogen needed and manages the mass flow controller to dose exactly that amount into the nitrogen stream. And what about the nitrogen purity checks? Well, the nitrogen check and restore feature works in the same way it does with our NGP+. So it monitors the nitrogen purity at the outlet of the MPH and intercepts it if it does not meet the application's requirements as specified by our customers. Can you talk about how you build the MPH to work well with hydrogen? Yes, so first it's important to underline that the MPH uses just a small amount of hydrogen. We're talking about PPM, parts per million concentrations. So the typical risks of working with hydrogen, such as embrittlement, don't apply. This also explains why the machine does not need to meet the requirements of the European ATEX directive, since the machine itself will never be used in an explosive atmosphere and the hydrogen concentrations never come close to the lower explosion limit of hydrogen. Nevertheless, we did dedicate special attention to the hydrogen topics in our FMEA, the failure modes and effects analysis, for example, to minimize the risks of valve leaks. Since hydrogen is very small and light, we introduce the hydrogen evacuation valve set, which avoids accumulation of hydrogen in the machine during a standstill of more than two days and also ensures a safe restart. Okay, so we talked about protective features. Are there any other components of the MPH that maximizes our customer's convenience? Yes, there are. The goal was always to offer customers an automated and autonomous operation, which is why we gave the MPH an automatic standby mode and overflow protection. 
and that protects the MPH both during startup against an empty net and also during normal operation. And that's it? That's most of it. Uh, maybe one extra feature worth mentioning is the room hydrogen analyzer. That is an external option similar to the room oxygen analyzer that most of you will know already. With that, we can wrap up this extensive look on the inside of the MPH. Thank you, gentlemen. There you go. The engineering that makes the MPH the ideal high-purity nitrogen solution. If you want to find out more about the MPH, contact your Atlas Copco representative today or visit our website. <laughs> <laughs>